Oh, it's that time. How are you doing, parents? Yeah. Halloween costumes? <laughs> mm, not there yet? Uh, starting to wonder if their uh, kids are too old to go trick-or-treating is a question. The big day is on Monday, so let's kind of dig in a little bit more. Uh, Julie Cole, co-founder of Mabel's Labels, back on the show, uh, parenting author and Mama Six, also joined by Lokifa Hogason, Acker entrepreneur, <laughs> community builder, and proud mama of two. Yes. Good to see you. Love Thank that fascinator. You. Thank you very much. Good to see Thank you. Thank you, Coral Earth Finery. Uh, yeah. Hamilton made, yes. by the way. Um, yes. Always have to represent. Hamilton shout <laughs> Love it. <laughs> How are we doing for Halloween? Um, hey. We're yeah. doing okay. Yeah. I mean, I'm going to say at this point, parents, if your kid wants to change their mind on a Halloween costume, Deadline's over. No change of minds now. <laughs> Is it right? really? So, yeah, uh, Lohifa, how old are yours? Seven and five. Seven and five. Yes, okay, so yes. you're prime time. You're kind of like oh, me. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. No, we start talking about costumes in January. Mm -hmm. Do yes. you? Oh, yes, okay. absolutely. My and kids are always very excited. What are we going as? Well, my son's going as a skeleton and my daughter's nice. going as a mermaid. Okay, mm -hmm. so um, for, for us, ours are, ours are done too, but I, they got them early. They got them a couple weeks ago and they've, they've been wearing them around the house. Yeah. Oh. So that's what you get worried about is like, they wreck the costumes or they get sick of them and they want another one. But but we're still good. Nope. We got we got a witch. We Nothing's got a ninja. Right. So we got a black awesome. cat. Oh, we're, good. We're, okay. we're good. To, we're, ninja. We're, we're, that's we're nice. We're good to go. So then Monday comes and you get the influx of all this candy. Right. So right. what do we do with all this candy and the highs and lows of candy? I know. Look, I can say having gone through this a bazillion times because mm -hmm. my youngest is 13, um, that I've done like the switch witch. I've done the donate. I've done the yes, like have yes, a little bit now, that. have a little bit later. Rationing, absolutely. The <laughs> rationing. But you know what? Like interest. Interestingly, it's a common myth that kids get these sugar highs, but there's actually been no scientific evidence yes. that it's connected to their behavior. If anything, it's been debunked. Yeah. <laughs> yes. And it's really just them being super excited. Right, exactly, yeah. yes. What Has do you do with it? Uh, we, we ration, you ration we give it, it away, okay. we store it. I've got yeah. ha Halloween candy from last year in do my you? car still, absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> Longevity. So by the time Christmas comes, I'm like, nah, it's going in the garbage. So, okay. um, so we're around, we're working around the same right. age, Lisa and I. So yes. like, I, in, like in the past year, like obviously the first couple of days are huge. Mm -hmm. But then they tend to kind of forget it's they around do. because do. we don't kind of put they it out really there. Like we put it away, we control it, and they'll have to come to us yes. to get it. True. And it's tough. You don't really want to be taking it to school. Like it's kind of a home thing. Mm -hmm. That's kind of what we do. How you guys do it? But, yeah. yeah. But there's no script. No, right? there's not. So there and you know, you've got to just do what works for you, depending also on right. the ages of your kids. Like That's I'm true. not going to now start. Uh, to me, I'm a big natural consequence kind of mom. Mm -hmm. So you know, if you want to binge and feel crummy about it <laughs> then that I, I'm at this point going right. to let that happen because also pediatric nutritionists are saying you know what if you try to ration too too much right. then they're gonna be doing like sneaky stuff true, or they're true. gonna fixate right. on it That's you know true. so That's there's true. some there's different and again it, it's age and whatever works for your family I and so to your too. point they do forget about they it they do the yeah. other day my son uh, had candy in the morning at school and we walk in I drop him off and his friend says well you can't have candy in the morning I said well he can yeah. <laughs> I <allowed laughs> actually it. Yeah. thank you very much yeah right yeah. And well, it's and that's, for you yeah. it really well, is and to that point that's exactly right they're right. saying don't say things are good food or right. bad food right. call it what it is exactly. it's candy it is you know candy. that's right yeah, yeah, let's right. just normalize right. yeah. absolutely um, yes, yes. okay 13 year olds your youngest yeah okay um, when do we go into your old when, when, where are we at with the youngest? Right, so mine will go out for <laughs> Halloween. Mine go out for Halloween for as long as they want to. Yeah. I'm a big fan of, you know what, we complain that teenagers are growing up too fast. Mm -hmm. If you want to trick or treat, if I'm participating Halloween and you turn up on my porch, I'm handing over the Snickers. That's okay. right. You know, yeah, like, I agree. Yeah, I, I just agree. think, why not? They're I just, agree. they're there. And you know what? We can't even tell sometimes their ages. 11 year olds That's can true. be six feet tall. That's true. That's right? true. I know a 13 year old who's 6'5. Wow. Yes, Goodness. exactly. And he will be trick or treating on he, Monday. Oh, <laughs> good. Yes, yes. Seven my house. And how many is he get? How old are you? <laughs> I know. He gets out of the But for kids, we're running out of time here, too. But like, for kids, when does it not become a cool thing to do anymore? Right. And then you're going out with your friends and then you'd be getting into like as a little bit of trouble. As long as you have an under 10 year old with you, a kid under 10, yeah. you can keep going. My, son, right. my older ones might wear a mask and bring a younger sibling. <laughs> right. Like they want evidence yeah. of connections to kids, you're good. But you're right yeah. too, because I know for my teenagers, they're hosting a big party on Saturday oh, night yeah. as well. Okay. Okay. And I'm dressing up as Regina's mom from Mean Girls. <laughs> <laughs> I, got my, I got my pink sweatsuit, my martini glass ready. <laughs> awesome. So That's it does awesome. change Super for mom. sure. It does. Yeah. It does. Here's it does. the thing, I know for a lot of new parents that have never really done it 
be fun. just have fun with it. You yes. know what I mean? Even Absolutely. dressing up with your kids, yes. going. Yes. It is a lot of fun and to it's, take it's the kids. And it's community service too. Yeah. You're giving. You're showing kindness. Yeah. You're yeah. And you know what? You're maybe right. seeing neighbors that you don't 100%. normally see. Yeah. You. You're yes. meeting people yes. in your neighborhood yes. for the first time, and that's what we find, and that's why we love to go out Absolutely. with our, with our one, coffee mugs. Exactly. <laughs> coffee mugs. And one final reminder: I just say, let's try and make it accessible. We want all the kids to have fun. So if you have some non-food items for kids who might have food allergies, if you have a kiddo in your neighborhood who has a mobility device, maybe beat the end of your driveway right. so they don't make have to navigate to stairs. Right. But let's right. just make it fun so for be conscious of all that. the kids, right? right? Okay. And the teenagers. I'm with you on okay. that. Yeah. Bring yes. me one of those fascinators <laughs> if you, next time you come will. on. Thank Thank you. You. Great I job. Will. Good to see you, J. Cole. Good to okay. See you. Um, happy Halloween, everybody. <laughs> happy Halloween. Enjoy. <laughs> <laughs> trick or treat.